Can't believe I've been missing this out. And that is the intense blue under a direct sunlight. Welcome to Car Scene Korea. I introduce newly released Genesis Hyundai and Kia cars. And the car I have behind me today is Elantra, the PE model. And Hyundai now calls the facelifts as PE, which stands for Product Enhancement. And I have those two cars right underneath the sunlight. You are seeing the Avante, and that's what it's called here in Korea, but North American market and other overseas markets, as we know, this is Elantra. If you haven't checked out my exterior and interior review of this car yet, make sure you go check it out in the card above because I've gone through them extensively, but that was inside a showroom, as we all know. With that being said, let's go inside and check it out. Just look at this. You'll see momentarily, but the reason why these letterings and the characters are standing out in 3D is because they have the whole AR, VR, augmented reality, and virtual reality going on with today's event here in Seoul, Shincheon. So they have this bunch of challenge going on right now, as you can see. So just scan those QRs and you can get started with this VR and AR games. Beautiful interior. I just absolutely love the bright interior that Hyundai Motor Group is recently pumping out and that has been also implemented on this entry-level sedan being Elantra. All these I've covered it in my previous video but once again just check it out under a sunlight. What you would expect to see in real life. Beautiful color all around for sure. So the beige interior matched with somewhat grayish door panel. This you could say it's a monotone. However, the materials are different. Above is the plastic and so is this panel right here. However, in the middle is the fabric. So you might be confused. They almost have a very similar texture as well, but they are two very different materials. With the stitches running through here, I really do like where the door handle is positioned. It's all ready and it's all within your reaching point all right so once again these cars I've covered intensively in Hyundai Motor Studios Howard before, so make sure you go check out that episode. Nothing much has been changed when it comes to the rear compared to the front of the car, but there is definitely a different design aspect on the rear portion of the vehicle. It seems like both of these vehicles are actually a fully loaded trim. I mean, I know not all of you guys are going to check out my previous video, so might as well just quickly go through the exterior of the vehicle. But nothing above from this middle portion up has been changed, but from middle to bottom. The diffuser is there that wasn't there before. The different wheels, the tabooed design language in cars, of course, the most prominent difference on this vehicle is that DRL headlights because some people pointed out that the car looks somewhat awkward in terms of its front proportions because it kind of looks too slanted or too angled facing downwards but not so much when you see it in person. Elantra is definitely one of those cars that look really different in person versus on the video. The front nose of the vehicle let me give you a various angle out of this car. So this is what you could expect to see in real life. Looking directly into the emblem. So it sure does give a very, very different feel and look depending on which angle you look at the car. And this is what the car looks like from the front on a car's eye level, I would say. So that is like the beauty shot for the Elantra from the front. So enough of the cars, I'm actually here to play. And I think I can do it by scanning the QR codes and download the app and let's get into the virtual world. Let me scan the QR code. I should just be able to do it with the camera app. This takes me to this link right here. They have collaborated with the Ninetic. Hope I'm saying that right, but those who developed Pokemon Go, this is a serious deal. And I have pre-registered. Right here, I am at Shinchon Street. A pop-up comes up and it tells you 
there is the mission to where you are so you actually have to be on that place in order to get the game going haha <laughs> so this really does feel like a pokemon go indeed it says there are eight documents not sure which would be the which but let's go check out the ar so maybe it's this flag right here or is is it that one probably try this one out okay so i got the first one the story behind the r d so there are eight airbags it's got the dual stage advanced airbag both on the driver and the passenger seat all right so success let's go for the next one so this is what you are looking for the photo so, so that is actually the korean word and it's i think it's right here and there we go so just like that so hopefully i'm not giving out the answers just too early i think i'll be posting this one up after the event all right so pop up next one it's the harder one i actually have to look for you see this right here so this is the sign and that can be found everywhere here and there that is the sign that looks like that i should be looking for and probably i could use also the navigation to check this out let's see let's see take your phone and just walk around this streets of korea kiosk going on kind of telling you showing you what this is okay i got it i got it so this this is the one yes well, hopefully this will recognize okay it does and it's really responsive you know another r d next up the bus we saw that on our way up here so it was more like a character right a red bus character okay okay so that one i'm pretty sure it's that one see it's really interactive as well got it got it got it it actually stays where it is just like the actual vr and the ar another there's another one all right so okay so that was actually quite the distance away from where the elantras were elantras are actually sitting over there but i was actually a street away so just in case you want to come check out the place that is the where i got the 1-1 right in front of the green building hopefully i'm not giving out too many answers here but hyundai is going to like it better because they want people to participate in this event, right? I personally really do enjoy this like creative way of promoting, integrating this ARs and VRs. It's this one right here, this guy, right? All right, got it. The files that it pops out in this Shincheon area is all safety related features of Elantra. There's another one. So there's this Dunyu right here and okay i got it quest number seven all right the spec sheet it's either this or that so let's go i think it's the last one you see i don't see anything after the number seven is it going to be the blue one and is it yes 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 so surround view monitor first in elantra this was definitely a huge plus when i first saw it and you know and i know that it comes with such because you see there's a camera right there i would strongly urge you to include them prevent yourself from one single accident you would actually get all that investment back even a tiniest accident with cars cost you a fortune and a lot of headache for sure right it's really interactive in a way because i am going back and forth experiencing the vehicle as well as the ar really the last one so avante is everywhere here and there is it this one i don't think so nope there is a lot of avante so there another avante i see is right here is it gonna be this one Oh yes, 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 yes. All right, you see, completed. And it's, it shows me, oh, look at that. The last piece of the puzzle, R&D. So it's got the BVM backup view monitor, probably. It says success. Okay, so move on to the next point and shoot for the star. And I am completed here at Shincheon area, as you can see. So on the smartphone, you see that building structure, right? which I do see in real life. How cool is this? Just so you know, I still play Pokemon Go these days. I actually do really like this event and game.
that being said, hopefully this video was helpful to you. If it was, don't forget to subscribe and like Cars in Korea. I can't believe I didn't point this out. If you actually become the winner of this event, Hyundai is going to give you a one year subscription to this 2024 Elantra. So shoot for the sky, you know, who knows? You might be the winner or I might be the winner, but I know I won't be, but I'll try my best. It's going to be a heck of a fun owning and driving this car for a one full year. And so that's it for today. I'll see you in the next video. Bye. You go into this inventory and also this is, there's this raffle. All right, so I checked in, the ticket's been used. You know, honestly, I just don't get really lucky with this, but it's obvious you have to get either the blue or red. All right, so I got the white one. I guess I get the entry level. All right, so this is what you get with the white ball. You should really come out and check this game out.